Hello my friends, today is a little bit of unusual episode but I think you will like it because I really like the idea and if you like my work I kind of think we resonate. So the idea is that whenever I feel bad I go and I think of my women that have supported me since 2011 both financially and in the time and energy they put into consuming my content, into implementing it and into letting me know that it worked or what didn't work so we can both improve. And these are the words that I've collected from letter A to Z. And these words are actually words of empowerment, the words that I tell my friends, the words that I tell my clients and the words that I read to myself when I'm feeling down. Uh, I will be reading them from A to Z and you feel free to write them down and to write down especially those that resonate with you and to pay attention after you've written them if maybe some of the words you think they can't go together. And I know that you will probably think of that, you will see why. And I just want to tell you that I've met women who are, who are both those words in the same time. And that is the beauty of women, that we are all different and that we are all a collection, like a puzzle of different emotions, feelings and different life stories and different mindset and experiences and that we are all beautiful in our unique way and that only women that are not accepted and don't accept themselves are the ones that are mean and negative because those, that is not how a woman is supposed to be. A woman is supposed to be a force, a force that supports herself and that supports her family and that supports her children and her community. And I believe when women, is, when women are feeling well and woman feels well, she is the brightest, most beautiful light to be around. And if you see a woman that is upset or being negative or gossipy, send her love and give her some of these words and try to make her feel empowered to bring her back to herself if possible because the world really needs every woman that can actually be happy in her own body, mind and skin and empower those around her to have a better life. So here we go. How do I see my women? Active, abundant, admirable, affluent, appreciated, approved, Assertive, assured, at ease, attractive, authentic, awake, aware, beautiful, blissful, believing, brave, brilliant, calm, capable, captivated, carefree, cared for, caring, centered, cherished, clear collected, confident, congruent, connected, content, courageous, daring, delighted, desirable, distinguished, dynamic, eager, efficient, elegant, elevated, empowered, encouraged, enthusiastic, exceptional, experienced, exuberant, firm, flexible, focused, fortunate, free, friendly, fulfilled, gentle, genuine, gifted, glowing, grounded, growing, happy, healed, harmonious, honest, honorable, humble, important, in control, included, independent, influential, inspired, intelligent, interested, interesting, invigorated, invincible, joyful, kind, learning, liberated, loved, loyal, lucky, magnetic, Marvelous, masterful, meek, merciful, mindful, motivated, neat, noble, observant, open-hearted, organized, pampered, 
compassionate, patient, peaceful, pleasant, pleased, popular, positive, powerful, praised, precious, prepared, productive, proficient, progressive, prosperous, protected, prudent, punctual, purposeful, qualified, quick, quiet, radiant, reassured, receptive, recognized, regenerated, relaxed, reliable, relieved, replenished, resolute, respected, respectful, responsive, restored, rewarded, rooted, satisfied, secure, selfless, self-reliant, sensational, serene, settled, sharing, skillful, smooth, suited, spirited, splendid, stable, strong, successful, supported, sustained, tactful, teachable, temperate, tenacious, tender, thankful, thoughtful, thrilled, tolerant, tranquil, triumphant, trusting, understanding, understood, undisturbed, unhurried, unique, united, valiant, valuable, valued, warm, wealthy, willing, wise, wonderful, worthwhile, worthy, yielding, zealous. I hope you guys enjoyed this and I hope that you wrote some down and that you're going to listen to this again and make a decision how you want to feel and see which of these words resonated with you and which of these would you like to borrow and maybe put on your vision board or choose one of these words to be a year, a word for this year, from May until December. Choose how you want to feel. For me, the word for 2020 is grace. I want to feel graceful no matter what. I love you guys and I'll talk to you tomorrow.